Hello guys, and today we are going to make stuff. So today, don't worry, I can do this, and you guys will probably see it. I can do this, and you guys will pretty much see it. So, I'm just going to use this, and I'm going to break it into pieces. Break it, but that's what we need our these so utensils, I have a knife, but I don't know where that went. So, I can't use that. Time is crazy so I'm just filling in these pies any way I can. My strips are too long. When I cut them, I realize I've wasted a whole bunch of time making perfect mummy bandages, and they all just fall apart. And so, oh my gosh. And so I'm just cutting this. So it's easier, but this is like really So, yeah. And this is really hard. Usually you can, like, tear this apart, but this clay is really hard, so it's hard to tear it apart. No. And don't mind her. Mom, it's recording. Don't do that. No, I'm sorry. It's okay, though. Um, it's fine. It's okay. I'm used to it. You guys might not. So, yeah. Just get your clay. And then pick it all up. Get it. And then you're going to make an ice cream cone with it. But first, you're going to need this. And so, what I want to do is use my tools and like push on it. And there. So, it easy needed I just like to do that so easier. And I can just to look into my viewfinder, but I shouldn't. I know I shouldn't, but I'm gonna move my viewfinder so it's easy to see. Okay. Yeah. It's upside down, but you can see me uh, upside down. Anyways, it's kind of easy here to see it upside down. Make sure you can do that all the all the time. Like um, it kind of gets it like easier to need. So just in case like you if you don't like needing it and it's really hard because sometimes it gets stressful for me. It just stresses me out. I'm getting a new type of clay. I've never used this clay. It is. Um, oh my gosh, now I can't see. Wait one, guys. Wait one second, guys. My viewfinder is being annoying. Well, it's not being annoying. It's because I'm seeing it to down. And so, if you guys can see this, uh, focus. Well, it's called Craft Smart, and what it does is it's just, um, it's just another brand of clay, so if you're wondering what it does, it's just another, if you're wondering what it is, it's just another brand of clay. And it also works, but it's really hard. And there's also a Primo clay, which it also works, just... All clays are really hard when you get them, usually. Some air dry, but really air dry clay, I think it's like soft. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
Wait, where's my camera right here? Alright, so I'm not going It doesn't really speak too much uh, money. There was a lot of opportunity here with your pie crust to add flavor. When you walked up here, I went, yay, we're going to have a hit, but what we have is a mess. Yes. All right, Amy, thank you very much. Thank you. I'm feeling crap. I just take my beating because they're right. Amy, what did you make for us today? I made a rustic mango money tart with a little bit of chantilly cream on top. And I like little candy eyeballs. What were you thinking? I don't get mommy or any of the things that you describe this dessert to be by looking at it. No, I don't. It says mommy to me. The store-bought crust is a little saltier, so I think what the filling needed was some acid to balance out the salty and Do I just do this and so then I just bunch it up because I don't know what? I mean, um... See that? And then it'll be like... Thanks very much. Thank you. Easier to me. 